Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome to another video. I am really excited for this one for a couple of reasons. Today we will be doing a full day of eating and training like Tristan Lee, who if you don't know, has one of the most outrageous physiques out there right now. And he actually does abide by a carnivore diet. So if you didn't know, this past week, I was doing carnivore all week. This is the last day. So I think that this is probably the closest that I'm gonna be able to get to the true Tristan Lee experience. So we've got a full day ahead planned, but for now we're gonna cook up breakfast, which is gonna be just a little bit different than what I've been doing this week. I'll show you. So if you have been following along with my carnivore diet on my Instagram this week, you know that every day I've had four pieces of bacon and four eggs. In this case, Tristan actually goes for two pork sausages along with those four eggs, and that's it. Honestly, six days in a row, the same exact thing. I don't mind the change too much. Do you think after a whole week of cooking just meat, I get better at not burning it, but not the case. So here we go, we got meal number one. I'll put the macros on screen here. This should hold us over through the gym workout. So we're gonna eat this and then head to the gym. Okay, sweet sausage, definitely not as good as hot sausage. So we're gonna wait about an hour or so before we head to the gym. We have a crazy workout coming. So the next time I see you, we'll be there. So guys, on this diet, Tristan maintains well under a 10% body fat percentage and he looks absolutely crazy. So if we're gonna look the part at all, uh, we're gonna take some nitric oxide, get the blood pumping. I haven't taken this in like a week or so. Hopefully it'll help out a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so the workout we're doing, I'll put on screen right now. It's gonna be a high rep arm day with a couple supersets at the end and then a little bit of abs after that. I haven't done an arm day only workout in years, so hopefully we can make this work. Um, so we're gonna jump into a quick warm up and then we'll just go through each exercise. Let's do it. Me, me, me at the London. If you find time, we can run one. Talk about some things we can undo. You just in the pen, I can find you. Six one on the money, nine two. You just said a word and I run through. Two texts, no reply. That's, That's the first burnout. Do one more I of those. Knew, yeah, knew, yeah. so I'm never get the clothes as the cash grows. Get a nigga whack like you get the grass mold. I'm talking slick, when I'm with the big slime, nigga. Could hit your bitch, you could never hit mine, nigga. In my DM, they elect. Side, nigga. No catfishing, this is not a fish fry, nigga. Never switch sides on my dog. Catch a contact, hit your ride, go to Mars. Everybody say, How could you come about your face and say, I ain't the hardest nigga you'd have never heard? I left a black a rapper's dead and bird. A verse for me is like 11 birds. It did the methods like $2,000 every word. I'm on the purge, I beat the church. I kiss some niggas and I walk away from it. Then I observe just how you curve. And told a nigga that they got away. I know, I know you ain't hot the man I'm ballin' on them pussy nigga like you want a man I'm drowning all inside the pussy like I never swam Hey, fuck your IG, I put something on your sonogram on the man <laughs> Me, me, me at the London If you find time, we can run one Talk about some things we can undo So last move is gonna be tricep extensions That's gonna be super set with push-ups We just did one set and at this point Our arms are done, it's all good uh, that's when I knew, I knew, I knew, yeah, I knew. Hip talk, church talk, I can make a brick walk. Up north, down south, bank head to Rachel walk. Hit it with a little water, stretch it like a vocal cord. STD, I ran my ward, fuck a fed and his daughter. I'm a rent a compound, yeah. I supply the sugar and bread. I got a man and she gon' ride. She took a quarter and she fled. I'm in the land, so she gon' ride. So to end off, we have a couple ab exercises. We're gonna do leg raises on the bar and then just crunches on the mat. And that's gonna pretty much wrap it up. So that's what we have left. Let's do it. I've been on the road like a pair of spinners and stopping goals. Yeah, I can charge them like a dudge and a demon. Got you brought in the garage, you ain't semen. Every time a nigga go back to the ward, niggas act like they won't start and we leave them on that semen. Me, me, me at the London. If you find time, we can run one. Talk about some things we can undo. You just in the pen, I can find you. Six one on the money nine. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap up the arm day and ab workout. We are about to head back to the apartment, get a little food, and then we got something else special planned a little bit later. So, um, arms definitely fried after today. It'll be a little bit of, be a few days before we do something like that again. So I'll see you back at the apartment for our next meal. 
just got back from the gym here. I will show you on screen the macros and the food that we have for lunch. Um, in Tristan's day of eating, he had uh, a fattier cut of steak. I've got the rest of my flank steak here. So we've got four ounces of steak, four ounces of ground bison. Uh, in his case, it was ground beef. And then two ounces of fish. In my case, this is salmon. So we're gonna eat this really quick, uh, digest, and then we've got something cool coming up for us next. Honestly, after eating on carnivore for about a week or so, none of the meals are really noteworthy. So um, in that case, the steak was probably the highlight, but that's only because it was the warmest. The seasoning's all the same. So eating just sort of becomes like a task and a thing that you have to do throughout the day. So the meal was fine. Um, that's pretty much how I describe all my meals the past week is it's fine, it tasted fine. Um, it did the job by giving me energy. So that was the review of meal number two. And we actually only have one more meal that we'll be having for dinner. Okay, what's going on guys? Clearly we've changed locations here. I don't know if you can see my face at all with the sun in the back, but Tristan's also a very good soccer player. So we have taken to the nearest pitch to see if the zero carb diet um, is one that's gonna take us through this workout. So let's try it out. This one is for 20 push-ups. I think the answer to the can you play soccer after a week of zero carb is no. I think I'll probably need to do it a lot longer before I can get used to this, the energy levels. All right, man, here's the deal. Right about two thirds of the way through that soccer session, I hit this wall uh, that I have not hit all week. So super props to Tristan for being able to do this. I am right at the end of my rope here. And I am making a full video on my week of carnivore. That'll be coming later. But finishing up this day of eating and training like Tristan Lee, um, I feel pretty darn well beat. And we have one meal left. Let's just get into making that because I am hungry. So the last meal of the day, we have a welcome, four eggs, and then four ounces of ground bison. So that's gonna do it. This is our last meal. It's our last meal on our whole week of carnivore as well, but let's eat this and then we'll go over the total day macros and just recap everything. All right, last meal down. So that is gonna be it for the full day of eating and training like Tristan Lee. Final macros are on the screen right now. Obviously this is a more of a, more of a cutting diet, but also honestly on carnivore, you really do have trouble eating, overeating as well, as long as you're not eating too many sausages or yeah, I don't even know how else you would overeat on this diet, honestly. After that arm day workout and then going to play soccer, I'm 
done. Um, I feel like I'll be full for the rest of the night here. One of the benefits of a restrictive diet like the carnivore diet is that there is no real snacking or extra calories. So for the most part, uh, you pretty much have your main meals and then like that carries you pretty much throughout the whole day. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I would like to do more of like these in the future. So if you have anyone in mind that you want me to do a full day of eating and training like, let me know in the comments, send me a DM on Instagram and I will certainly get to it. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Okay. Good. I'll sit. Look at that, man. Oh, no head. It's a point. <laughs>